Hello everyone. If you remember last year when we released Service Pack 1 for Exchange 2010, we told you that we now support changing of expired passwords in OA. And the way to enable that feature was to create a new registry key using the steps in this blog post. There was one limitation though that you cannot use your credentials in UPN format while changing your password. That is something which we have recently addressed in Rollup 3 for Exchange 2010 Service Pack 1. And I wanted to show you how that works now. So let's take a quick look at my Exchange 2010 server where I have RU3 installed on top of Service Pack 1. I also have enabled the change password feature using the registry key which we just saw. Now let's go and use OA to change an expired password. So I'm logging in as a user whose password has expired and I'm expecting that page where OA will ask me to change the expired password. Here it is. I'm going to provide my user credentials in UPN format. After I provide my current password and the new password, I'm expecting to see that page where it says my password has been successfully changed. There you go. We now support UPN credentials and change password feature in our Thank you.